Nothing lasts forever, not even the batteries inside lucid electric cars. After serving for some years, they have to be retired as their performance drops noticeably. Batteries can contain materials that harm the environment, hence their disposal is worth thinking about. If Lucid wants to be an environmentally responsible company, it needs to have an end-of-life plan for its batteries. In today's video, we will be diving into the second life that Lucid gives to its batteries. Before that, here's a big welcome to New Vehicle Media, your go-to channel for all the latest updates on Lucid Motors. Feel free to subscribe to stay tuned, like the video, and leave a comment down below. We might just feature your comment in our future videos, just as we have done further on in this one. So, back to Lucid and its future batteries. First, what are the dangers of old batteries? Are they friends of the environment? Handling electric vehicle batteries can be problematic. They weigh a lot, from 293 kilograms in the Nissan LEAF to a whopping 540 kilograms in the Tesla Model S. So bear in mind that swapping out the battery isn't as easy as pulling out your phone from your pocket. Yet, the human race is set to see three and a half millions of such behemoths in circulation by 2025, according to Bloomberg, and 11 million tons of them by 2030, according to AJ Kocher, the CEO of the battery recycling company Lee Cycle. You've probably guessed those batteries are recyclable from the name of Kocher's company, which is correct. They can be reduced to their raw components and reused. However, only 5% of lithium-ion batteries in Europe, for instance, get recycled, so there are a lot of batteries floating out there. But that isn't so bad if you consider that most of the sales of electric vehicles have happened in the recent years, so most of the batteries are still operational. Electric vehicle batteries last about 8 years under warranty and can be stretched further to around 17 years. But surely down the line, there will be a glut of heavy and old batteries that can no longer provide enough range for the owner. As all our videos, this one is also divided into chapters. These chapters are marked as timestamps in the description, which help you navigate through the video at your own pace. What happens if not recycled? That depends on how they're disposed of. If not done properly, they can eventually leach chemicals into the soil, which is really bad, as they eventually make their way into plants and bodies of water, endangering both animal and human lives. It is as serious as your next cup of water being tainted by a used electric vehicle battery. There's also risk of fire from punctured and leaking batteries if they're simply stacked somewhere and left to rot. So, it is better for all if electric vehicle batteries are handled properly. Various Options When it comes to dealing with old batteries, Lucid has several options. As stated already, the company can recycle the raw materials, breaking them down into their individual components. The raw components from the battery packs include steel, copper, aluminium, and plastic, while the individual battery cells yield cobalt, lithium, nickel, and manganese. Lucid can sell them off and make a few bucks, or reuse them in new batteries. Remember, Lucid knows more than a few things about batteries, as they started off as a battery-focused company. Beyond reclaiming raw materials, Lucid car batteries can be repurposed. The fact is that not all applications require the intense power electric vehicles need, which opens up possibilities. The old batteries can still hold considerable charge, even though they are no longer fit for vehicles making them suitable for use in diverse applications. For example, they can be dumped in heavy-duty equipment that does not move at high speeds nor covers much distance, such as forklifts and tugs. They may also end up on energy storage farms, where they can hold energy produced by solar power for creating balance during times of increased demands or to supply the stored power during the night when the sun doesn't shine. Speaking of shining, Lucid can give up the old batteries to be used for street lights especially during times of disasters and such. The batteries can also have domestic value too, as they can power the average home, which consumes between 6 and 12 kilowatt hours of electricity each day. This means even a 40% degraded electric vehicle battery with original capacity of 24 kilowatt hour can store enough power for a household. This is not theoretical, as it is already being done in places like Sweden and England and Portugal where a whole smart island is being built off used electric vehicle batteries. So, Lucid isn't without options when it comes to deal with old batteries. 
but what is Lucid planning for its old batteries? Despite not having sold a single car yet, Lucid is actively thinking about its old batteries. To start with, Lucid has designed its batteries for life after the vehicle, so they're capable of giving and giving. They're very similar to the ones used in energy storage, which means Lucid sees a scenario where the batteries are simply slotted into their new homes without much modifications required. To demonstrate this, Lucid has already built a prototype 300 kilowatt hour battery storage system in its labs. They had to use the new batteries, but hey, they haven't sold a single car yet, so where's the old battery going to come from? But the system will work with any of the batteries swapped, whether new or not, for any doubter out there. Lucid will probably get the old batteries from its service centers or when customers take advantage of Lucid's trade-in programs where it will run quality checks and extract the modules from the battery packs. That quality check will be a breeze as Lucid has already built sensors into the battery that monitors down to the module level. Will the batteries be repurposed for domestic or industrial use cases? Lucid is taking its time to decide, but one of the key people there is thinking about the dollars as they consider a full-scale energy storage system business. This is similar to Tesla's energy storage business, but it will be using old batteries. Chief Engineer and Senior VP of Product Eric Bach told TechCrunch he felt industrial application would be more appropriate and easier and fetch more dollars per kilowatt hour. He also hinted that his company may offer incentives for dismantlers to turn in the batteries of the Lucid cars that end up in their shops, but is totally fine if they start their own trade in batteries with other companies or recyclers. Lucid is, however, not going into actual battery component recycling, at least not yet, despite their pedigree in all things battery. The reason is economics, as the volume will be too low to justify any investment for the foreseeable future. It will leave the business to its battery cell suppliers, including LG Chem. But that may change in the future, as Lucid sees itself evaluating how things stand and may even go into battery cell production. In that case, it would be interesting to see what extra value can be extracted from the old batteries in the way of raw materials. This would go in line with Lucid's production principle of doing as much manufacturing in-house as possible. So, if you really fancy a Lucid home battery system, you have a few years to wait, but you can rest assured Lucid is already thinking about how to responsibly dispose of its batteries. You can also enjoy the benefits of the bi-directional charging of their luxury cars, which means you can power your home from the energy stored in your car battery. The Wrap Up that's it for Lucid and its old batteries. Clearly, the company has thought their sustainability through and leave a green mark on today's world. We give them kudos for planning for responsible handling of their old batteries at this stage of their existence. Joe Smith commented that unless Lucid has a supercharging network, they won't be able to catch on. Thanks for the response, Joe. What are your thoughts? Will you pay for an energy storage system built from Lucid's old batteries? Does Lucid's future effort make any difference environmentally? Feel free to use our comments section and maybe we feature you in our next video. Here's also a reminder for you to like or follow us to be sure you don't miss our videos. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in the next one.